Um, okay, today, so I'm going to show you um, how to install Mumble, which is a voice chat program, obviously. Um, to install it, first of all, or at least get it downloaded, you're going to go to Google. If my web page ever loads. And just Google Mumble. It should be the first link, mumble.sourceforge.net. It's going to take you to a page that looks like this, sort of like Wikipedia. Um, it's going to obviously say Git Mumble. And for Windows, you're going to do 1.2.3 Stable. Uh, Mac has a stable, and Linux has a stable. So you're just going to click the one you want. And it's going to take you to this page, where it has your Mumble download will start shortly. It's gonna, if it doesn't give you a, uh, this type of file can harm your computer, or you sure you want to download it, you can use the direct link or another mirror. But if this works, just click save, and it'll start downloading. However, I, um, already have it downloaded multiple times, <laughs> so, uh, I'm just gonna drag it out of my downloads folder. However, if you're downloading it in your browser, you could probably just click this when it's done to run it. So I have this, um, I'm going to click it, you're going to run install, it should give you a security warning if your security, uh, your, uh, security for your Windows is at default, like mine. Um, it's going to take you to this setup, it's going to go next, accept the terms, it's going to tell you where you want to install it, if you want to install it somewhere else, that's fine, but I just used the default and then click install and it's going to install and I believe give you another sort of setup window it should take a minute here, don't know why and then it should come up with a user account control why it comes up with this I have no clue But, uh, oh yeah, it comes up because of administrator settings. Anyway, you should be done. And if this is your first time installing it, then you will get the audio wizard, audio tuning wizard, which will help you go through and set this up. So, headset, microphone, earphone... And then you have this goofy thing. Just want to read it and follow it, set your latency. And then this, so you can test your audio level. And then this is push to talk, um, uh, voice activated, and not sure what this is. Have no clue. Yep, have no clue. I used to push the talk. And this will let you do quality settings. If you have slow internet, you want to do low. If you have decent internet, balanced like me. Or if you have, like, that really expensive, super cool, fast internet, do high. And uh, if you want to do text-to-speech, this will be like if you join a server or someone else joins a server, it'll tell you using that funky uh, text-to-speech. It sounds weird. But I like it, so I... You, uh, enable it. Then you have this. So you position your audio. Me, I have headphones. If you don't, just uncheck it. Hopefully you have headphones for your mic. And then this, this is just if you want to send anonymous statistics, like crash reports and stuff, then you should be done the setup. And then you should be able to run Mumble or it'll run it for you. And you want to uh, hit server and connect. Then, um, it should bring up a whole bunch of public internet ones, but I just ignore those. You want to click Add New. Label, what it comes up as, so, for instance, for us, Guild. Address, which would be the IP, which is in the Guild info, so something like 67, yeah, whatever. And then the port, which is like 69875. And the username, which would be didn't even spell my own username right. Anyway, you click OK, and then once you connect, it'll say you have a wrong password. And you just enter the password. Don't know why I didn't let you enter it in the first place, but uh, 